Thousands, thousands in Israel continue to march on the streets of Tel Aviv after six more hostages were found dead in Gaza. One of the hostages included Israeli-American Hirsch Goldberg Poland, who was, has family here in Maryland. Not only is pressure for a ceasefire mounting in Israel, but it is growing here in our area as well. WJZ Live at 6, Dennis Valera on your corner in Pikesville, where he heard from one of our local Jewish communities. What are the, how are they responding to this, Dennis? Denise, the Baltimore Zionist District says that they lost six loved ones, not only them, but the entire Jewish community. They want the rest of the hostages to get home safe and for all of this to end. Now, the Israel Defense Forces, according to them, the six hostages' bodies were found over the weekend in an underground tunnel. Since then, as you've mentioned, protests have erupted in various cities in Israel, all calling on Israeli President Benjamin Netanyahu to agree to a ceasefire deal, all while Hirsch Goldberg Poland, one of the hostages who was found, was laid to rest. Now, the Baltimore Zionist District says there has to be more effort at the negotiating table, fearing we're going to lose more hostages. Do I fear that this will happen to more hostages? Um, I'm sorry to say, but yes. I do fear that it will happen unless uh, more steps are taken by both the United States government and, and the Israeli government. Now, according to a statement by Governor Westmore, Hirsch Goldberg, Poland's family here in Maryland lives in Montgomery County. Now, the Baltimore Zionist District, they also want more to be done to address anti-Semitism, especially on college campuses. Reporting live on your corner in Pikesville, I'm Dennis Valera for WJZ. I right, thank you very much, Dennis.